Hello guys, what's up? Thank you so much for watching Circuits Bazaar. So today we are going to learn a very interesting project. The name of this project is Temperature Controlled Switch. So through this project, you can control a lot of devices in your home like your ceiling fan, your exhaust fan, whenever the temperature will rise up. So you can set a threshold limit. Whenever the temperature will cross that limit, then your device will be on, whether it's your ceiling fan, whether it's your bulb, whether it's your uh, exhaust fan, whatever device you want to attach, you can attach because the output port which we will make in this project will be of 230 volt, right? So you can run anything through this project. So now we are going to make this project. The circuit diagram of the project is given in the description below. So you can download and if you have any doubt, you can ask me in the comment box. If you enjoy the video, then you can like and subscribe the channel. Thank you. So this is the circuit diagram we are going to discuss. This is 9 volt battery. So this will go to the 7805 voltage regulator. 7805 voltage regulator. Okay. This is the 5 volt and this is the ground right now the ic which we are going to use is lm358 ic pin number 8 is vcc means 5 volt pin number 1 2 3 4 pin number 1 will be output pin ic name is lm358 Pin number 4 is ground. So this is your 5 volt. Okay. So wherever 5 volt is needed, you will provide from here. This is our temperature sensor of 3 pin. Right. First pin is VCC, means 5 volt ground pin and this is V out which will go to the pin number second of LM358 IC and pin number third will go to the potentiometer ground 5 volt okay so this is all about the circuit now uh, we have to connect the relay for example this is the relay Relay is a 5 pin device as you know that Right and uh, this is the coil This is the point which is attached over here, but after It will get activated. It will go to this point, right? So you will apply 9 volt here and uh, You can use a BC 547 transistor to amplify the current coming from this V out out signal is pin number one signal so you will apply out signal here register you can use 100 ohm and you can ground this pin right uh, this is relay so now how it is capable of controlling device uh, for example this is your fan and this is your AC one wire you will directly connect to the fan and another wire of the fan will come from relay you will connect this point here and this point here right so this is all about of circuit this circuit we are going to use in our project this is very simple circuit right no complexity at all pin number five six seven we are not going to use actually uh, this is also a comparator and this is also a comparator but we are going to use only this comparator not this one so now uh, if i talk about uh, uh, this is the relay which we are going to use this is the relay and this is the ic lm358 ic this is bc547 transistor which will we will use over here this is bc547 transistor bc547 and uh, this is IC base this is 7805 voltage regulator right and uh, 
these are some register which we can use like a uh, hundred ohm register we are using over here and we can use the led as well over here just to know that whether this ic is producing signal or not and another thing uh, we are we are also going to use a uh, diode and led on the relay as well so that we will came to know that whether uh, relay is on or off by just seeing so this is register of uh, you can apply 470 ohm register right and this is red led you can connect this red led to this point means collector of the transistor base and you can apply a diode in a reverse bias mode okay and connect these two point to this 9 volt wire right and this is temperature sensor which is lm35 so these are some component we are going to glow a bulb so this is the holder which are we are we are going to use and uh, this is the uh, 230 volt port which we are going to use right so now we are going to build the circuit and this is the pcb on which we will make our circuit so now i have inserted all the components so that it will take less time for the soldering right uh, so according to the circuit diagram so this is the circuit diagram i have inserted inserted all the components so now i am going to do the soldering So now the soldering part of the project is complete so this is 230 volt ac cable this will provide 230 volt ac to this jack where we will attach uh, this bulb and this uh, female jack so we can drive anything whichever we want from this uh, jack uh, this socket right and uh, this is the bulb so i'm gonna attach both of these two to this connector <coughs> These are the plastic gitti. These are the small plastic holding which can hold the project. right now we are going to fix before that we are going to test whether project is working or not this is the 9 volt battery through which we will provide power supply to the project now we will increase the temperature around this temperature sensor Power supply was off. Now you can see. 
system is on whenever the temperature will increase so we are going to decrease the range right so now we are going to fit this is the glue gun through glue gun we can fix the complete project now we are gonna Uh, project ready now uh, this is red this is black red is above uh, above side and black is below side this is plus and this is minus this is plus this is minus as you know that plus is red so I write down red here and minus is black okay so now we are going to test the project live so this is the power supply which is 9 volt battery you can make directly to 30 volt adapter as well over here this is the power LED which is representing you see your circuit got power now and uh, uh, this is 230 volt AC right which is directly drive uh, this uh, socket and this bulb you can glow this bulb whenever temperature is right you can attach fan as well over here so it's all depend upon you you can attach anything whatever you want okay so now uh, I'm gonna increase the temperature so you can use this soldering iron to increase the temperature this okay now you can clearly see because temperature is high that's why this bulb is on and you can see this relay LED is also on whenever this relay is on this LED is on whenever this relay is off this LED will be off okay uh, again I am gonna show you the working of this project now you can clearly see bulb is on because temperature is high whenever the temperature will decrease then bulb will also off whenever temperature now temperature will go down the bulb will be off after some time so instead of this bulb you can attach some exhaust fan or some fan also here it's very simple right so this is all about this project if you have any doubt regarding this project then you can ask me in the comment box if you enjoy the video then like and subscribe the channel thank you